The following opinions are solely those of Boatest.com and its test captain. Hi, welcome to Boatest.com. I'm Captain Steve, and today we'll be taking a look at an award-winning boat from Italian boat builder Monte Carlo Yachts. It's the MCY 76. Now to say that this boat is award-winning is a bit of an understatement. She's actually won an unprecedented grand slam of awards, including two World Yacht Trophies, Boat of the Year in 2010 and 2011, European Power Boat of the Year, as well as the Nautical Design Award. Now, since we're all boaters, let's take a look at the MCY 76 from the top down. Overhead is a very large retractable sunroof to expose the entire bridge deck. So over to the port hand side we've got a very expansive sun pad and L-shaped seating and it's interesting to note that every time you see a cushion on the MCY 76 there's storage underneath. In this case we have storage for the teak tables that will go right in front of the L-shaped seating. The stainless pedestals are covered with teak boxes that get stowed in the radar mast when the table is being used. I also like that the table raises and lowers with a switch at the helm. Over on the starboard side, just above the helm, you have a sink right next to that, an electric grill below, ice maker, refrigerator, storage bin. And notice there are courtesy lights all around the deck. As we continue back to the aft deck, we've got two deck chairs here. Obviously, this can be used as a boat deck, and in the event that you do that, a crane will go into this position right here so that you can launch the tender over to the side. Most people that buy the MCY 76 are using the hydraulically actuated swim platform for storing their tender. Now let's take a look down below deck. Coming down into the aft cockpit, 16 feet across by nine and a half feet fore and aft. Beautiful teak table. And in this position, it makes a two-tiered buffet, but you can also close it off to make a very expansive dining table. It'll rise and lower electrically, so it can be used as a dining table or a cocktail table. Seating for six, plus two on either side. And here's an interesting feature on both sides of the cockpit, these sofas. I have never seen this in a boat in this class. The warping winches, the teak deck, the table, all standard equipment. Side decks are 17 inches wide, 33 and a half inch high bulwarks. Now right at the side deck, there's a watertight and weathertight door. Simply push the button and you can hear the catch is being released. Then you can open the door and in its fully open position, you still have room to transverse the side deck. The side decks all converge forward in a Portuguese bridge which gives you access to this beautiful bow sun lounge area. The sun pads have flip up backrests so that you can effortlessly convert from sunning to dining. Two teak tables flank the walkway and stainless handrails are conveniently located. Their storage underneath the cushions and opening panels to the sides access additional storage. Both tables raise and lower at the touch of a button. Coming forward, pop-up LED lights. And here's a holder for a vertical support that will cover the entire foredeck in a bimini top so you don't always have to get complete sun while you're here. Now notice when you get up to the working end of the bow, you've got a recessed area that drops down, deck drains on both sides, and this will increase the height of the bulwarks to 26 and a half inches, so you're very safe while you're working the ground tackle. Anchor roller recessed into the bow, quick windlass with foot control just underneath. Roomy storage to either side for fenders. Also, you have access to get underneath and undo any tangles that may occur. Now here's an interesting feature. Under the starboard hatch, I reach way down, you've got a shower for the foredeck, controls for the windlass, and look at this, a firefighting system. And all of this is standard equipment on the NCY 76. That's our look at the flying bridge and exterior features of the Monte Carlo Yacht 76. For my take on the living spaces, be sure to watch our inside features video. For BoatTest.com, I'm Captain Steve. We'll see you on the water.